Hello everybody and welcome back to the 2B2T Museum and in today's episode I am touring the base Indus Deep. I think that's how it's pronounced. Anyway we'll start with this little port on the edge of the thing. There isn't really that much above the surface. Um, but I think it goes underground for a ways. And yeah there's also quite a bit in this ship. Let's try running around the outside. Yeah, some storage in the boat. It's quite neatly done. And let's see, a nether portal. You know, maybe there's some part of it's in the nether or something, but it's generally not a good idea these days to have one of these near your base. If there was, it wasn't uh, in the world download, I guess. Anyway, let's start with this building over here. Okay, let's just fly over. Okay, we have some farmland on the edge of the swamp. Some kind of windmill, well, water wheel, should I say? Yeah, it's a water wheel. Okay, that's nothing. Snacks. Cactus farm. <laughs> Where's the door to this place? Alright, here we go. Neat. Uh, Alright, let's see. We've got a little library. Can't see the enchanting table, so it's probably somewhere else. Um, let's walk up here. I think I've ever seen anything quite like this before. The, the tracks running up through the house is probably pretty common, but I just haven't seen it. Alright, it comes up into here. And I have no idea what is actually going on with this exit. Oh, yeah, you can jump down there. Now, let's see. It's like a roller coaster. I actually wish I had a minecart and could take it for a spin. Alright, so that runs around there, comes back down here. goes actually. Mostly because it's a bit of a mystery. Uh, let's see. Apparently it just loops around inside the building. Anyway, that's enough for that one. Let's check out this tower over here. There's all the supplies piled up on the docks. Um, check out the rest of this. Don't think you can really enter this thing, whatever it is. It's a lighthouse. Is there anything else over there? 
Right, let's check out this before we go underground. <laughs> uh, this big brick structure that. Not sure if this is what it was planned to be or given by all the crates, uh, all the chests, it was probably meant to be something a lot bigger. Anyway, let's have a quick look in the front. Alright, some kind of furnace building. Even has a switchable on switchable plate door, that's handy. I'm guessing it's not quite done as big side it. Caution tripping hazard. <laughs> ah, I can duck down here for a minute. Not much to this dig site. Uh, I was expecting a giant hollowed out crater underground, but doesn't always happen. Yeah, I think there's quite a bit to this base underground, so I'm just going to go over here and have a look. And this neat fountain thingy. And yeah, this looks particularly spectacular. Quart, docks, lighthouse, the deep. If you come this way, stables. Oh, so you, yeah, it's how you get into the lighthouse. Nice. Oh, put a lot of effort into this. You know, I've never bothered with carpet. Alright, and... Alright, so you can sort of get up just below the light. Neat! Actually, really impressive. And yeah, I didn't notice any of this from the angle I was looking at it, of course. Right, let's go the banners or whatever it was, the other high level thing. Signboard Hall of Banners. does seem a little empty so yeah I think there's just some missing or something may have not keen in the world download or anything let's go downstairs to the deep this is neat. I've never really bothered with this kind of uh, building. Alright, so fish farm. And some chests. I do like how they've gone to the trouble of carpeting everything. Yeah, it doesn't really get done very often. Uh, let's see what's over here. Gardens. And... yeah. Hmm, this is giving me ideas. But I don't think I'll ever get around to it. I'm so glad I have a silk touch pick. And, uh, I don't have to go through the job of smelting all of that stone. Neat. Hmm. 
Yeah, one of these days I'll probably make something like this. But uh, that'll be some ways in the future. Yeah, if I do ever make something like this, it will show up on a video on this channel. But I wouldn't hold your breath. I probably wouldn't bother with the redstone lights, but... I'm mostly playing with 1.14 these days. Right, let's go to the Great Hall. Which is behind us. And... Ooh, nice! I see what they mean by a grand hall. A brewing area. chandeliers. I've done something a bit similar but with lanterns and torches. Nice, we'll just come up here and check out this place before we go back. Nice! Certainly a uh, pretty impressive place. This down there, and it's going all the way up there, so let's carry on. Mob grind enchanting area. There's an enchanting area. Lots of animals in there. And the mob grinder that. And in hole, engage Kalora and have a weapon. You obviously can't do much with that. Right, let's go down here. Let's just fly down here. Nice. Yeah, this place is wild. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, there's more to it too. What is this? The dance hall? I don't think it had a name. Still, it's very impressive. This must be one end of it. Um, let's head back this way. Livestock. All right, livestock storage. And yeah, farm. Nice. Anyway, that appears to be... Okay, automatic ammo. Huh? That looks like it's all of it, I think. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please leave me a like. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel for more daily videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time on the 2B2T Museum.